pronounced, defined, used in lexical dispatch. Droll, adjective, noun, and verb. Drollness, drolly, humorous in a peculiar or whimsical fashion. Jester, clown, goof, to make fun. Hermitage, noun, the home of a hermit. Retreat, sanctuary. Seclusion, solitude. Hermitage, a red or white Rhone Valley wine. His droll remarks kept everyone at the party entertained throughout the night. The comedian's droll delivery of jokes had the audience in stitches. Despite the serious topic, she couldn't help but add a droll comment to lighten the mood. The cat's droll antics never failed to bring a smile to the family's faces. The professor's droll sense of humor made even the most mundane lectures enjoyable. The movie had a droll charm that appealed to both children and adults. In the midst of the heated debate, he injected a droll observation that diffused tension. The novel had a droll narrative style, blending wit with poignant moments. His droll expression suggested that he was well aware of the absurdity of the situation. The painting captured a moment of droll irony, leaving viewers with a thoughtful smile. The comedian's drollness had the entire audience laughing uproariously. The children giggled as their teacher drolly imitated the characters from their favorite storybook. The historic hermitage nestled in the mountains served as a tranquil retreat for those seeking solitude. The artist found inspiration for his paintings during his stay at a remote hermitage in the countryside. The hermitage, with its simple lifestyle and connection to nature, appealed to those seeking a contemplative existence. The hermitage on the outskirts of town was known for its serene gardens and peaceful atmosphere. The monks dedicated their lives to prayer and meditation within the walls of the ancient hermitage. The small hermitage in the woods became a haven for those looking to disconnect from the hustle and bustle of city life. The family decided to convert an old cottage into a hermitage, creating a peaceful retreat away from the urban chaos. The writer chose a secluded hermitage by the lake to work on his novel, Undisturbed. The term urban hermitage gained popularity as people sought ways to create pockets of tranquility in bustling cities. In the metaphorical sense, his cluttered office became a hermitage where he immersed himself in his work. I uncork a bottle of Hermitage, a renowned red wine from the Rhone Valley, to celebrate a special occasion. Each subsequent glass of Hermitage allowed me to appreciate the craftsmanship and terroir that contributed to this exceptional wine, making the evening truly memorable.